People undergoing surgery or with vascular problems are at higher risk for life-threatening blood clots. A medication often used for patients is called low molecular weight heparin. Low molecular weight heparins work by blocking one part of the, the body's natural clotting cascade, so it decreases the ability of the body to form a blood clot. In addition, we can use low molecular weight heparins to treat someone who has already developed a clot like a deep vein thrombosis, or one could also have a clot in the lung called a pulmonary embolism. Patients that also need low molecular weight heparins are those who have just had a myocardial infarction or a heart attack. It also helps prevent clotting there as well. Low molecular weight heparins are only available by prescription and are given by injection. When patients use low molecular weight heparins, it comes as an injection. It should be injected into the stomach or the abdomen. One should alcohol the area and not touch or blow or use a towel. Let it air dry and then just pinch the skin about an inch and the needle is the right size. You put it in at one angle and pull it out the same way. It is critical that patients are aware of the side effects from these medications that can signal a problem. What we do want you to monitor for is signs of bleeding. So if you have excess bruising, if you see blood in your urine or your gums, then you need to call your physician. It's normal to have bruising over their abdomen where they're injecting the medication, but any other bruising or um, bleeding would be of concern. Your physician and pharmacist are both valuable resources and can answer any questions you may have regarding this treatment, including how to manage side effects.